This is a countdown video. It contains my own personal opinion on the subject matter. If you don't like my opinion, well, go make your own video for all I care. What is just as equally important as Mother's Day? Father's Day. So, just like last month, I've decided to do the exact same thing for a present. Now, you may think that this might be hard considering all of the horrible dads that we've seen in anime, but if you look hard enough, you might just find some hidden gems. So, without further ado, here's my top 10 fathers in anime. I can remember how much I have had. I drank a 12 pack with my dad. Uh, that's my son, the drunken manly stud. I'm proud to be his bud. Number 10. Sojiro Izumi, Konata's father from Lucky Star. While this character isn't necessarily the greatest person in the world, especially what he does in his free time, it's creepy. When it comes to his daughter Konata, he's the greatest person that he could possibly be. Raising one girl, later to be two girls, can't be easy, but Sojiro manages to do it with ease. The way that Konata is like is based on how he raised her, which might not sound like a good thing, but he does a good job teaching her the things that he knows, even if those things might be questionable in of itself. Number 9. The Wolfman. Yuki and Ani's father from Wolf Children. Even though this character is only in the first third of the movie, and I won't say why so no one gets spoiled, the time that he was around signifies how much of a good father he was. In the very short time that he was able to stay with his kids, he tried to teach them the things that he knew, even if they were at a very young age. You also seem to sense his presence throughout the rest of the film, as the rest of the family struggles to live on without him. That's my son, the drunken manly stud. I'm proud to be his bud. Number 8. Vegeta, Trunks' father from the Dragon Ball Z franchise. Now, you may be asking me, why would I put a character who put the entire world in danger multiple times over a character who saved it every single time? I did this mostly on the part that Vegeta is technically a better father than Goku, just on the basis of him being with his kid longer. Whenever Goku was with Gohan, the only thing that they ever did was train, and Goku was dead when Goten was born. Also, as Piccolo said in the Abridge series, This can't be about the job. The first chance you had to drop this gig, you tried to hand it off to Goku. Goku! He doesn't even look after his own kid. I look after his kid more than he does. Vegeta is at least alive when Trunks was young, and while Vegeta does train with him, he at least spends more time with his kid. You might disagree with me, but Vegeta is as just as good as a father as he is the protector of the planet later in the series. Dry your tears! We're going to the park now! <laughs> It's my son, the drunken manly stud. I'm proud to be his bud. Number 7. Tomohisa Kaname, Madoka's father from Madoka Magica. When I try to think about it, I can't think of another father in anime who stays at home to take care of the house and the youngest kid, while the mother goes out to work to provide for the family. There is just something very impressive about that, especially in Japan. When it comes to housework, Tomohisa does the majority of it, especially since his wife always comes home after work very drunk, very late at night. While Madoka may look up to her mother the most, this father does his best to support his daughter and the rest of his family in the best way that he can. That's my son, the drunken manly stud. I'm proud to be his bud. Number 6. Spirit. Maka's father from Soul Eater. It can't be easy to be a single father after having a divorce with your wife and then trying to get along with a daughter who practically hates his guts. There are of course reasons for this, but it's still hard. Spirit tries to support his daughter at every opportunity that he can, though mostly from a distance. What on earth are you doing, Spirit? I'm sending positive energy to Maka so she'll do well on the test. Okay. Anything else? No. Continue. Even if his attentions are often misunderstood because of poor misunderstandings, now if only he can break a lot of his old habits, he may be able to do this in the end. Hey, Soul Eater! If you even think of touching my Maka, if you lay a hand on her as a death sight, no. As her father, I will freaking kill you! You got me, you little octopus head! What are you smoking? 